Hello everyone, today I'm going to be uh, speedrunning Portal with hacks through the console, or the developer console. So, uh, Valve games actually allow for hacking like this, and they make it pretty easy, so I'm just going to go ahead. I'm not going to be going for a high speed record, I'm just going to see how much fun I can have just messing around with things. I've done this before, and I think I'm getting pretty good at just running through the game. So, and I'm going to try not to edit this video as much as possible. So first thing you got to do is type in save cheats 1, which will activate the ability to use cheats and give item suit. That gives you the HEV suit from uh, Half-Life 2, which allows you to run around and jump around and crouch really easily. So there's not really much we can do right now, <coughs> other than just kind of stand around here and mess with the radio. But, um, Hello, and again, I will be able to get the, the uh, here, I'm going to turn down the audio. I will be able to get the Half-Life 2 weapons after the first two puzzles. So we actually have, I'll, I'll show you guys this now. I have this copied, and I can just spawn these in easily. In fact, I'm thinking we should just, actually no, we can do this faster. So this is probably the only part that you can't really do anything to skip. Oh yeah, we're also going to turn on no target and god, which allows us to be ignored by the turrets, which will cause for some pretty funny moments. And um, god mode allows us to not die, which is also pretty funny at times, because you can like uh, fall in the water and skip entire puzzles at times. So I just spawned in a cube there. Just to kind of speed by this one, because that was the only thing you had to do. You can't really... You, you can't skip the elevators either. In fact, I think there will be a test coming up here. That it's like completely impossible to skip. Oh, we missed the... Well, I believe now we will be able to uh, go ahead and type Impulse 101. Perfect. So now we have all the Half-Life 2 weapons, as, the of as well as the, the button. Button. This, test. this will allow us, having this portal gun, this is the uh, dual portal gun, so you have like all the portals. This will allow us to skip through quite a bit of chambers early on. Okay, so You're this is the one with the first well, appearance of the portal gun. That a noticeable taste of blood is not part of any test protocol, but is an Skip that very easily. Of the aperture science material emancipation grip, which may, in that one might be one of the easier ones. We will also be able to skip a lot of puzzles by just using the cubes to build um, towers. That's also uh, pretty funny at times. Please proceed to the chamber lock. Oh. Mind the gap. Okay, that was a mistake on my part. I'm sorry about that. Well done. Remember, the Aperture Science Bring Your Daughter to Work Day is the perfect time to have her tested. Some of them get kind of difficult because um, the puzzles are designed to have no much portal go off. This one we will just drop that in. It's just funny how fast you can run through these. There's a good amount of speedruns that are like just insane. And they don't even use hacks, they just use glitches to get through walls and stuff. I think I saw one, I think the fastest was 8 minutes long. So this one is weird, I think you have to have one of these. Just 
fine, because yeah, you can't really run through. It's fine, because we'll just do that. As part of a required test protocol, our previous right, uh, statement right suggesting that we would not monitor this chamber was an outright fabrication. Good job. As part of a required test so I think protocol, we're almost we at the part where we can just the get the normal three, portal gun. Two, and after that, it'll, it'll be pretty easy. I think there might be at least one or two different chambers. If I remember correctly, the one coming up here is the one that we don't have to use any portals. Yeah, it is. Okay. We're going to be able to get up here pretty easily. We're just going to spam three of those. Now you can't jump on this. You can't jump on this normally. You have to jump disabilities. Such as so we just skipped the whole entire Please be puzzle. Careful. Now we don't really need any of these guns. The only ones we need are the gravity gun and the portal gun and the rocket launcher later on. Warning devices are required on all so we'll skip through this one again. However, alarms and There's one later on that it might actually be easier just to do the whole puzzle. But you can build like a really tall safety. tower out of blocks to get through. The aux power goes down whenever you sprint and portals. I mean not portals. The elevators are a good way to kind of recharge that. Please know that we have added a consequence of failure. Any contact with yeah. the chamber Yeah, so we can survive this. You normally die here. But we can... We can just go down here. Get a bunch of these. And... We are running out of oxygen. But that's fine, because we have god mode enabled. I believe it's fine. Oop, we knocked over our whole tower. Yeah, I'm not very good at stacking these underwater. Might actually be easier to use the gravity gun. There we go. And it does look like it's um, destroying the gravity gun as we go through, but it's not, so we're fine. Okay, this one's pretty funny. Yeah, we have to wait for the elevator here. But it will... Will come. It's actually kind of funny. Later on in the game, you will actually come back here, and this whole section will have like an area you can go down in. And it actually doesn't the have that. The center apologizes for this clearly broken test chamber. Yeah, there we go. So there, there's an area that we'll come back to down there. And it's actually kind of funny because you can just like, I don't know, it's not the same here. Once again. If you know what I'm talking about, then you probably know what I'm talking about. Hello again. To reiterate. This one you actually kind of have to do. There's no real easy Check way to skip mode. past that one. You appear to understand how a portal affects forward momentum, or to be more precise, how it does not. Momentum, a function of mass and velocity, is conserved between portals. In layman's terms, speedy thing goes in, speedy Seen a good speed out. run of Half-Life 2 with a portal gun. I can imagine that one would be pretty easy to do. I'll pro 
probably do a Half-Life 2 speedrun later on. Using these, uh, same hacks here. This one's one of my favorites. Because, since we have God mode on, there's actually a button down here. So normally you would have to wait for um, different portals to be placed, so you could go over and get the normal portal gun, but since we already have it, we can just skip through that whole thing. And for this one here, you need a box there, because that opens the door up there. This will just go ahead and open, and then we can jump down like normal. So I decided to do this with Portal, because I've played the game. I've played Portal so much that I basically know it, like the back of my hand. It's a pretty, it's a short game, which is why I decided to do this one first, but I might do a series of Half-Life, Half-Life 2 videos. An intubation I may also do Half-Life Source, you with since that's basically just Half-Life 1, just with the Source engine, which will allow us to be a lot easier. As part of a previously mentioned required test protocol, we can no longer lie to you. When this one, we're just going to go ahead and do the... Cube. All subjects Technic. intending to handle high energy gamma leaking portal technology must be informed that they may be informed of applicable regulatory compliance issues. No so that's easy. All of the elevator ones that aren't blocked off are really are an excellent test subject. I think there are a few um, tests coming up that we're not going to be able to skip. The Enrichment Center is committed to the well-being of all participants. Yeah, see, this one, we, there's no and easy way to skip it. I mean, you could build up, but Thank it's you not for as fast. Us help you help us all. Just gonna go ahead and back into this. Now, you can do this without any sort of cheats once you get that elevator going. This one. We're actually gonna go over and spill over this one. Because that one's pretty easy. Since we have god mode, we won't die here. So let's just swim through. This one's another one that you can build like a big tower to go up there. Actually, you know what? We're not doing this for time. Just trying to break the game basically, so let's just go ahead and do that. It's actually going to be easier to use the gravity gun because it was designed for things like this. We may 
have messed this one up a little bit, but it's fine. It might be easier just to run through the puzzle like normal. You know what, we're just gonna have to run through it. We actually had that stairs there. That helped us get up faster. <coughs> this one is the turret run. Turret one. This one's kind of my favorite for this uh, speed run. Because it's just, it's really fun to just run through this one, and it's pretty funny too. See, the turrets won't even fire at us. In fact. Android. The Enrichment Center once again reminds you that Android Hell <coughs> is a real place where you will be sent at the first sign of defiance. I believe the Companion Cube Chamber is up next. Yes. The vital apparatus and will we don't deliver need that. a weighted Companion Cube in 3, 2, you can actually catch these, which is interesting. Don't know if you could do that. I think they're they're like the same thing as the dark energy or whatever they're called in uh, Half Life Two. So if you like pick them up and throw them, they're not the same. Or they, okay, they have to be from the, uh, dispenser in order to work. You did it. The weighted companion <laughs> cube certainly brought you good luck. However, it cannot accomplish- You know what? Letting you for the rest of the test and- Okay, the companion cube is not- Unfortunately, must be euthanized. Please escort your companion cube to the Aperture Science Emergency Intelligence Incinerator. Oh yeah, I forgot the... Um... The weight box is the same uh, entity. It just has a different texture. So we'll be able to fly through that one easily. The companion cube actually still is alive, so there you go. The experiment is nearing its conclusion. It's not the really an easy way to do this one. It's required to remind you that you will be baked, and then there will be cake. This is actually one of my favorite parts because just spam these. And one will when eventually land on the button. Destroy. Please proceed to the now this one's just easier to do the whole part of the whole test. You could build a big elaborate uh, staircase there, but it's easier to just do it like normal. For more information, please attend an enrichment center electrical safety seminar. Now I believe we 
We are coming up on the final test. Yes, Welcome okay. We're skipping test. all that. <laughs> when you are done, you will drop the device in the equipment recovery annex. Enrichment center regulations require both hands to be empty before any cake. Congratulations, the test is now over. All aperture technologies remain safely yeah, operational up to 4,000 degrees Kelvin. We're just going to skip that Rest assured further. that there is absolutely no chance of a dangerous equipment malfunction prior to your victory incandescence. Thank you for participating in this aperture science computer aided enrichment activity. Goodbye. What are you doing? Stop it. Hi, 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 hi. We are pleased that you made it through the final challenge where we pretended we were going to murder you. We are very, very happy for your success. We are so throwing a party in honor of your tremendous success. Oh, Place the device on the ground, then up, lie on your stomach with your arms at your side. Just gonna need to just do them like a party normal. associate will arrive shortly to collect you for your party. Make no further attempt to leave the testing so here's area. What I was talking about earlier. Assume the party has this for the same position, position or you will miss the party. And the elevator wasn't there, so now there's this part here which wasn't there before. So this part we're just going to be using cubes for. So that part is easy with the cubes. Normally, it's I find it to be um, kind of tedious to line everything up correctly. Okay, we're just gonna have to wait for this to come up. There we go. This is another one that you're just gonna have to wait for these to come down with. Because it's the only portal spot. that up. There we go. You really now, of course, I'd be able to do this a lot faster if I had more practice. This one always confuses me, even when I'm not using hacks. this guy over with a turret. I do recommend Portal. It is a 
this Great game. Your fault. It didn't have to be like this. I'm not kidding now. Turn back or I will kill you. I'm going to kill you. So normally you'd and use a rocket. Okay is on. You don't even but we're just going to use a normal Do rocket you? from Half Life 2. This is your last chance. And you would use one on the tube up here to just blow it up, but we just spawned one in. So this one's going to be a pretty easy one to skip through. It's the turret room. That's what I call it, at least. I think we have to actually step out here. Yeah. Now after this turret room here, we're gonna be able to go to GLaDOS's chamber. Despite your violent behavior, the only thing you've managed to break so far is my heart. Maybe you could settle for that. Boo, and we'll just let me play your song on the world. I guess we don't know point. that isn't gold. Going to just forget heaven, I said anything. You chose this path. Now I have a surprise for you. Deploying surprise. Hold that for a second. That wasn't supposed to. Now. Hold on a minute, I gotta get the physics gun upgrade. Probably edit through this. There we go. What is that? It's not the surprise. I've never seen it before. Never mind. It's okay, I guess we can't use that. Later by myself because you'll be dead. Where are you taking that? All of the thing? objects in Portal are actually really lightweight. I wouldn't bother with that thing. My guess is that compared to the ones from Half Life 2. Somehow. It has numbers on it. I don't want to tell you your business, but if it were me, I'd leave that thing alone. <laughs> so the portal gun actually has a really uh, weak grab. Seriously. Or weak, uh, yeah. Compared to the okay, no, grab to go. Pick it up and just stuff it back into me. <laughs> Let's be honest. Neither one right, of us knows what here. that thing does. Just put it in the corner, there it and is. I'll deal with it later. That thing is probably some kind of raw sewage container. Go ahead and rub your face all over it. So Glados is just gonna do her normal dialogue right now. Maybe you should marry that thing since you love it so much. Do you want to marry it? Well, I won't let you. How does that feel? And... We're just kind of taking a bit longer Have I here, lied to you? I mean, it'll in this room, trust me. If you want to do this at your own pace, then you can do that. Watch this. I am being serious now. That crazy thing is not part of it. You're kidding me. Oh, oh it opened. I mean, it closed. 
Yeah. And there. The portal has been beat. Now this part's kind of creepy. Because it'll just go through the dialogue of the normal of the battle. I'm just gonna hang out down here. Because you start to like, you start to float at the end. Just want to see if I can somehow skip that. Oh my gosh. Okay, you can't skip it. Because when the light goes, then that's whenever the game ends. So that was, that was Portal. Probably not going to edit it. Probably just going to upload the raw footage and leave you guys to enjoy it. Let me know if you want to see Half-Life 2 or Half-Life Source as well.